Welcome to the National Healthcare Safety Network or NHSN application training. This training is a brief and informative application navigation video from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. It serves as an educational resource for healthcare facilities working to prevent healthcare associated infections or HAIs. In this training, you will learn how to add a user to a facility. By the end of this video, you will be able to add a user to a facility, add user rights, and verify user has been added in NHSN. Let's get started. After accessing the SAMS dashboard, in the National Healthcare Safety Network System section, click the NHSN reporting link. You've now accessed the NHSN application and the Welcome to NHSN landing page is displayed. Next, select your reporting component. Under Select Component, click the drop down menu button or in Field to display list and click your component. Under Select Facility slash Group, click the drop down button to view the list and click your facility. Then click the blue Submit button to enter the NHSN application and access the NHSN component homepage. A notification message will pop up. You will click OK to exit out of it. On the NHSN homepage, on the NHSN home navigation bar on the left side of the screen, click Users to expand the user menu, then select Add from the menu to display the Add User page. On the Add User page, enter the new user's information in all fields marked with a red asterisk. Note, to ensure NHSN access, enter the same email address that was used during the SAMS application process. When all fields are complete, click the Save button. This will automatically display the Add User Rights screen. In the top left corner of the screen, a message will display stating, User has been saved successfully. Please add rights for the new user. The rights are the level of NHSN data the user's profile can access. This can vary per component. To add rights or level of access to patient data in the table under the rights column, there is a list of user rights under each component. Click the box for each right they need to have in order to perform tasks in NHSN. Once you have all rights with a check mark, click the Save button and the following message will appear. User rights saved successfully. Next, verify the user has been added to NHSN. On the left NHSN home navigation bar, click Users to expand the user menu, then select Find from the menu to display the Find User page. On the Find User page, in the User Information section, click the Find button and the user page will display. Review the list to verify the user you added is listed with the letter Y in the active column. You can also click on the user's name to display the view user page and verify the user is active. Once you have verified the user is active, you can exit the NHSN application. And this concludes the How to Add a User to a Facility training video. If you need additional support with using the NHSN application, email nhsn at cdc.gov or visit online support at www.cdc.gov forward slash NHSN. Thank you.